This week in Winthrop returns after spring break to catch softball action as the Lady Eagles battled Akron on Saturday and Brittany Stoudemire lifts this drive into center field which can't be caught allowing Katherine Eberlin to score all the way from first base to give the Eagles a 1-0 lead. Then a crazy play as Jenna Harbin comes home. Looks like she's going to be out at the plate but she makes an acrobatic leap over the catcher to score safely and Chelsea Shanefelt gets the RBI double to score Megan Chapman, and the Eagles went on to defeat Akron 9-1, dropped the first two games of the week to Georgia Tech. Baseball action away at Liberty. Cam Walters coming through in the first inning with the RBI single to score Tyler Cook and give the Eagles a 1-0 lead. Robert Lake would help make sure it held up as he went eight innings, allowing just one run, getting the strikeout there. Great outing for Lake. And then Cam Walters again in the ninth. This chopper to shortstop. A bad throw to first allows Patrick Gamblin to come around to score. And the Eagles picked up the 2-1 win on Friday night against Liberty. Unfortunately, it was their only win of the weekend. Track on Saturday. Very rainy finish to the A6 Winthrop Invitational. Kerry Sims completing the victory in the 110-meter hurdle. Sasha Robinson Also a first place performance this in the women's 400 meters running through the raindrops to pick up the win. Men's and women's 4x100 meter teams also picked up victories. Here you see the men completing the final leg of the 4x100 sprinting home to the finish and the Eagles quite an impressive meet at the Winthrop Asics Invitational. There you see the winners Men's tennis also a win this week with a 7-0 victory over Charlotte. Women's tennis also a 7-0 victory over Charleston Southern. Coming up, softball will be home against Liberty over the weekend. The Sunday game is on ESPN2. Baseball at home on Tuesday against Furman, then away on the weekend. Catch all the action on Winter Beagles TV.